Is it the fire of greed, fire of hatred, fire of resentment, fire of anger, fire of love, fire of compassion? What kind of fire burns within you? You take care of that, then you don't worry about your physical and mental well-being, it's taken care of. I've spoken in the prisons, I've spoken in many places <laughs> So you're here willingly. You're doing something willingly is the fundamental of your joy, isn't it so? Hello? However simple or stupid or idiotic activity it is, I'm doing something willingly makes a world of difference, isn't it so? Hello? The difference between heaven and hell is just this. You're doing something willingly, that's your heaven. You're doing something unwillingly, that's your hell. Hmm? We have already taken on attitudes, what we like and what we don't like. I like this person, I don't like this person. Now with this person I will do things willingly, with this person I'll do things un unwillingly. This may be two people, two aspects of life, two communities, to nations, to many things. This I will do willingly, this I do unwillingly. This means I've decided in my mind this is good, this is bad. When I hear even on national news channels, good guys and bad guys, it just… Once you have this kind of thing, you are going to be disastrous to the planet, it's just a question of time. The moment you decide this is a good person, this is a bad person, this has gone deep into American society. No, there are no good people and bad people. Everybody is oscillating between the two. If you create a very pleasant, wonderful atmosphere, everybody behaves wonderfully. If you create an unpleasant atmosphere, a whole lot of people act nasty. Yes or no? There are joyful people and miserable people, but there are no good people and bad people. Mm, that's big. That's big. <laughs> the, the moment we think we are good, we are entitled to destroy the bad, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, we've been destroying a lot of people for a long time.